Hello and good day, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to, well, Oddworld's uh, Industries. <laughs> Oddworld Industries. And this is going to be a crazy nostalgia fest, and it's going to be definitely very fun for me because this is a game back from my ye old days in my childhood where I would actually play this. Uh, I played this in the PlayStation 1. That's how old it was. And it's going to be definitely good. I'm going to just dive right into this. And I, I don't know, I tried it in hard mode because I was getting into practice and I thought actually like, what's the difference. And when I was first playing it, because I like, sort of completed it, I watched what, I played the entire game. I, I played through half of it and then I watched my brothers because I was too young to play a lot of the complicated puzzles and it can get quite hard um, with like some of the crazy puzzles and whatnot. Um running around all over the place and having things perfectly timed, which I could get frustrated about because I noticed there was a few in this game, a few lag, I, I felt like problems in a way where if I, was, I felt like Abe wouldn't move to the speed I would move him at in a way. You probably might see it a few times. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I might just go into normal mode because oh, this is just quite lethal. And also when it says lethal tramps, they were not kidding. I was there, I think I was here there were like 20 minutes once, just trying to disable a bomb with the whole hand uh, set, 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 you know, if you play the game you know what I mean, but yeah, I'm going to play in the normal difficulty, because why not, and I could actually play this in supposedly co-op mode, but it's basically just single, glorified single player, and yeah, I remember the controls because I had a little play around with it for about, I was supposed to have done it for only like 10 minutes, but I ended up playing it for like almost 2 hours, <laughs> but yes. Oh, it's so differently interesting to see this because all oh, this was like eight, like maybe eight bit, and it's all pixelated, which I still like the old art style more, to be honest. Um, and the actual 3D aspect of this game kind of reveals a little bit too much, as I'll explain in a little bit. Ah, yes, it does definitely look nice though. It's not like the highest of quality still, because this was also still updated in like 2008 or 2006. Maybe not actually, I don't know. I think it's a little bit older than that actually. But yes, it's quite nice to see. And then it's like, yes. Rupture farms. Ooh, spooky. It's like, yes. This was like, even though surprisingly when I was a kid playing this, it wasn't that spooky for me. No, well, in a way. The only thing that actually scared me in this cutscene was actually seeing just like Abe's actually like at me and whatnot, and that surprisingly creeped me out. And, that, <laughs> and also in later games, the Gluckens are really funny because underneath their cloaks, they're just all arms. Like they just skipped leg day a bit too much and they just their legs are just dangling and their arms are like massive freakishly arm, it's kind of funny. Hmm. Pretty nice. And yeah, some of them. <laughs> yep. Until the were yeah, it makes sense. It's a shame that in like later games you didn't see what they are. I'm sure you do in later games because you go in time or something. They are nice, supposedly. Mm -hmm. It's interesting that Abe knows how they taste like. Like Abe's like, I, I know what this tastes like. It, somehow, don't know how he's able to get that. I'm not hold of that. Yes. Yes. Bum bum bum. Oh, that's that, that music. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, so cool. The truth. And slugs, the most amusing part of it as well, because in later games you just realise they their legs are not a part of them. They are literally robots. You, you thought maybe they just lose their legs and their cyborgs? No, they're just they're just like kind of like slug arm um, things. We are extincting everything. Yeah. Interesting that also, maybe I was a kid, I didn't quite understand maybe what they were saying, or maybe they weren't actually saying English and now in the updated version they'll say this. Yeah, boy. Oh, no. 
Like, supposedly that freaked me out. I don't know why. I don't know. <laughs> Whatevs. <laughs> it was like, wow. Like, they look like feet there as well, but they are. They're just their hands and boots. It's kind of stupid. Ah! Oh, no. This is not good. Let's get out of here, then. I don't know why I have my hands on the mouse as well. Like, I just realized this entire game I could play without hands. Oh, uh, hands? <laughs> get me out of here. I, I am an ape, so get me out of here. <laughs> Oh <laughs> uh, yes, like this art style. I, I kind of like the uh, slightly angled uh, impressions. Two hundred ninety nine employees and zero escaped and zero casualties. Hopefully, I'm gonna try and get zero casualties, but knowing me, I will mess up somehow. <laughs> Especially because there's areas where they just put like loads of them in one place. It's kind of funny. But yeah, this is also like some. I I I, I sort of like the angled things. It definitely feels a little bit weird, but the thing I find a bit bizarre about this is right here, if you were to play the actual game, there was the uh, secret entrance where you're pressing down when you climb down. But if you actually move over to here, you kind of see the, the hatch what you can go down. So, I mean, and you can tell that he actually stands on it as well because it's on the actual bar. Yeah, you do have some where. Hello. It's kind of confusing slightly about this whole entire thing. Was I was, when I first played it, I was thinking this was gonna hit me, but surprisingly not. Yeah. Ow. <laughs> this is a bit dumb. <laughs> Getting used to these controls is gonna be a little bit weird. Oh, there's two here. Interesting. Hehehehe. <laughs> <laughs> that was a weird one. Well, see you later, guys. Have fun. I don't really care about this. Almost this. Nah, that's not. Let's mess around with you a little bit more. <laughs> Hello. Well, that was awkward. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I just left. I just love messing with this game so much. Well, that was awkward. <laughs> I think you can probably tell why I like this game so much because I'm literally just like a kid at heart messing around so many times. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> Don't mind me. Oh <laughs> uh, well. Well, whatever. Let's see. <laughs> see you later. <laughs> and this, the most important part of the actual entire game, knowing where to actually find these secret engines. Because as you can see. There is a secret entrance below me, and yeah, a lot of things like that. Cause yeah, uh, yeah, it just shows you all the literal secret stages, and there are seventy in this section. Wow, well, Jesus! Well, fair play. Oh no, there is like eight. Yeah, a few secret areas. As you can see by the trap door, you can fall down to to get to a new area or something. I don't know. A few of these areas are secrets as well. But yeah, moving on swiftly. Well, that was awkward. Yes, hello, good day. Let's move on. <laughs> that was awkward. Let's uh, let's try and uh, catch up a little bit with my little time and try and speed through this. Oh uh, yes. <laughs> That was awkward. <laughs> Almost failed already again. See, the whole thing about this as well, there should be an, an, another secret entrance, as you can see, by a hatch down there. Whereas, when I was to go down there, there'll be bombs there, which I can pick up to then just chuck down here, and then I can drop down and go through there. But obviously, for some reason, I wasn't able to go down there, which I'm thinking through later stages would be the whole idea of that. Yeah, well, you're going to be mine now. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> now let's just pull this little lever right here. Whoop, boop, 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 boop. Hmm. I can clearly see this lever is for that. Hmm. Oh well. Oh well. Moving on swiftly. Silly. Silly, silly fool. 
Well, let's move on, shall we? Woo also, I find the most interesting thing about this is the actual ragdoll. You can just move bodies around. And it is quite amusing. Because <laughs> let's just do a little test of Hmm. Oh well. Moving on swiftly. Ooh, that was awkward. I almost uh, could have shot an ape then. Or oh, a scrub or my docken. Whatever the words I say. Uh, yeah. Teddy ho. You don't know? Uh -huh. Come with me, minion. Adventure awaits us for freedom. <laughs> Go, my children. Be free. Well, that's that old business. Let's get out of here. Bye. No, that was not the one. <laughs> I just love this game way too much. It's all it's awkward. Oh, I find it so amusing. Good day, people. Follow me. We are going on a glorious adventure. And just in case of secret situations. Yeah, don't mind me, better buddies. I have a little opposition for you. See, I'm sh Hi. Hmm. Ah, yes, I remembered to me now. Hmm. What do you think? Well, well. Maybe I am forgetting something. I think I might be thinking something silly. Like I've, I, I've, I, I may have actually forgotten one of the actual secret entrances. Maybe I could just be dumb and be going straight to my doom, but no. Ha! I remembered it. Hello. Good day. Ow! That was painful. Uh, no. Uh, ow! Uh. I have lives, eh? Um, that's a different. So they made it live to make it more interesting, eh? Don't mind me. I don't know. I did not mean to press that. Well, that's one casualty out of the way. Hi there. <laughs> I can't obviously survive if I kill someone. That'd be foolish. <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. Yep, just sneak past you. Don't mind me. Hmm. You don't know, eh? Well, that was awkward. You don't know, do you, eh? Ah, yes. Hmm. I need to get this done right. Nope, 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 nope. Ow. I am failing at this already. <laughs> I've forgotten this controls. Foolishly. Ow. <laughs> now, where was I? Uh. Nope. <sighs> See, I. Bye. <laughs> Don't mind me. Bye. <laughs> Let's get rid of all this thing then. Oh, that worked somehow. <laughs> hey! Fascinating. Now then. Well, that's a lot of hellos. Good day. Wow, that's amusing. Come hither, men. For freedom! Oh. You guys are lame. Come on. Boop-a-doop-a-doop. -doop -doop. Come on, lemmings. 
Go! Freedom awaits you! Sweet. Well, <laughs> that somehow worked. <laughs> uh, I keep on going into stupid quiet mode. But yes, good, good. Now, if I remember correctly, I should still have some. I didn't get some more. Oh well. I guess I could go back and get some more. Whee! That's more like it. Good old fresh supply of five. Woo! Now it's more like it. Finally got five. Now I can finally go on my adventure with a nice action. I wonder if I go back further. Well, that probably explains that now, brain of me. Now, if I remember correctly. Hmm. Boom. Now with them out of the way, now I can go down here. Ah. Never mind, I played the entire game wrong. <laughs> hmm. I would have been waiting, just pressing down to activate it, but actually, I suppose I didn't press enter to activate it. I'm being dumb. I have a bad feeling like I may have killed someone doing that. Hmm. Interesting. How am I supposed to get this? Oh, okay. Well, that's one way of getting through there. <laughs> Oh my lord, I've finally done it. Oh my lord, jeez Louise. <clears throat> uh, for now the painstaking process of getting one down here. Damn it. I said just hello to one person, but they still remain to follow me. The other guys didn't. It's annoying. <sighs> I killed one. Yeah, it took me so long to do that as well. Okay, mm. let's get these guys out now. And now... Let's get them all down here. Probably a bit dumb. <clears throat> there. Finally got them all out of here. And uh, yeah, that's all fine. I can get up there without being all killed. And finally, freedom! Now I actually realize I can go through the hatches if I press E, I can go back and actually do that other one as well. Don't mind me. And yeah. Finally. Hmm. See, now this is the hard one because it's just absolute pain in the ass to get these guys through here. Luckily for me, though. Boom. Bye. Oh, too late. Let's just set forward a little bit more then. Hmm. There. Mm, 
don't know why I needed to do that, but oh well. So I was able to save a few of them so far. It seems pretty good. <coughs> damn it. I wasn't expecting him to run. God damn it. Goodbye, fair world. <laughs> Yeah, that's more like it. Oh yeah, I just remembered. Bye. <laughs> Don't know why I need to get rid of that, but oh well. Ah, that's why. Let's just get you now. <laughs> hmm. Now what? Oh. Ah, I failed. Probably should have pulled that lever and sprinted down here. Hmm. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Hmm. I have to go and die and see if I do actually need to do that. Farewell! <laughs> now then, the last one to finally save. Finally, I've solved it all. Now just hopefully I don't die. <laughs> Oof. Now, the awkward thing about this is I could cause the largest amount of Modonkin uh, genocide, but oh well. Let's get him out of here. Go, freedom! Ah, yeah, so satisfying getting them all out of here. Ow. Thanks, birds. You save everyone else, but you don't save me. Ah. Now I've got to get out of here somehow. Hmm. Just in case. I am going to save. Never mind. I won't save. How am I supposed to get through this, then? Unless I can open a portal using these guys again. Or maybe they won't let me. Damn it. Wait, I just realized I can easily come out the way I can get out. Unless I, I feel like I should activate that somehow. But I don't want to die. Hmm. I'm just gonna go over to a new sec point and then come back here and see if I can actually activate that door somehow. Or that lever. I wanna know what that lever does. No, I don't I can't, can't get through that. I've tried numerous times and I've I've come to the conclusion I can't get through it in time without getting crushed by it, so oh well. Freedom Yes, they put the. I think they put the sign up for the wrong species. Uh, ow. That was. That was tough. Also, kind of interesting how it says no talking for employees, and yet I'm the only one with stitch lips. Well, might as well see if there's an uh, emergency. <laughs> a, a secret entrance there. <laughs> it took a long time. Go, freedom! Now then. I need to get this right. It's thrown quite right indeed. Perfect. Nailed it. Now then. It's time for you to join the dark side. <laughs> it's alright, just accept it. Yeah, indeed. Let's go! Freedom! Hmm. Never mind. Not much freedom involved. Maybe I should have snuck past you. Somehow, which even though dropping to the floor would have woken you up anyway, so... Oh well. <laughs> now, for the horrifying, almost pleasant sight of him exploding. <laughs> now, if I remember correctly... 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> Just chop my head off of that. Hello! Good day! Now then, if I remember correctly. No. Wrong way. Now. Nope. Not the right way again. Boom. Now that's out of the way. Come here, my minion. See, now this mission would be so much easier because I got these bombs now. So, boop, 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 don't mind me. Yay, you say hello to me, damn it. See, now can you see this? No. <laughs> so much easier now, isn't it not? Yes. Come here. Yeah, I, I know that. I'm just saying that because these little pods here kind of can spawn dogs, but oh well. Wee! Because <laughs> this is an idea, this would have been so much harder without that grenade. Because I'd have to sneak past these guys, and it was such a pain in the butt. Now I can just literally freely walk through this as I own desire, and it's absolute kick walk. <laughs> so it's a bit like boop, 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 don't mind me. And then just do this. Do 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 do. Mm. Boom. Easy peasy. And now I can just simply do this. <laughs> yeah, that's more like it. Over here, laddies. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Come on, everybody. Let's go. Adventure awaits us. Boop, 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 boop. And this mission was done so easily. Oh, actually, I should get another grenade. Pop up on the grenades. You can never have too many grenades, especially in this game. Boop. Yoink. Don't mind if I do. Hey, that was pretty cool. Now, freedom! <laughs> yeah, that's good indeed. So many puzzles, so little time. Yo, I have returned. <laughs> That's the only weird thing I found about this game is that they've like got too many systems to like stop you from falling a ghost bit. Bit weird. <laughs> that had I slightly chopped my head off of that door. That was kind of funny. <laughs> and even the ragdoll physics as well with these lifts and doors is even more funny. I'm trying to think if it would have been needed. No, I can. I, I didn't have the need to um have to do anything like that. Oh, that's a shame. That's a shame. In the old game, they would actually have like a different reaction to each thing. So you'd be there like, "Hi, hi," and then you'd be there like, "Follow me." And then it would be other things as well, which would be like similar to that as well. But oh well. Let's do a little bit of a Mexican standoff. Who can kill each other first? Hi there. Ah, uh, uh, ow. Wrong way. <laughs> Clearly, not me. Hmm. Hmm. Freedom! <laughs> uh, I'm so cool. And now... Damn it. Wow, that's definitely a trap door to death. Maybe the spikes kind of gave it away. Now I think about it, it's kind of dumb. <laughs> oh well. I gotta test out all of them to make sure they work They work properly. Hmm. I wonder. Ah, that was dumb. I only have one life, supposedly. <laughs> the smell of searing flesh was nothing like a sweet smell of something bloody blah, some big pie. Sweet. Well, that was amusing. <laughs> but yes, I'm going to call this video here. 
I don't know why I had to be so abruptly telling you this information, but oh well. <laughs> and, yes, I hope you guys did enjoy this. It's probably longer than I expected. I've been recording for like 15 minutes now without even realizing it. Because I've been having my big game in... Never mind, I just had to awkwardly check if I was actually recording on my face cam. Luckily for you, I am. <laughs> and I hope you guys have enjoyed this video of Abe's Odyssey. It's a remastered edition as well. Sadly, it's not like full 4K and all this governs of high quality technology and stuff and visual aspects. But we are in the Unity engine, and that's actually saying something. Considering, like, <laughs> yeah, this was always, this was literally like a side scroller, and it looked kind of like a soul scroller to an extent. Like we have like the background layers in a way, like we have here, but it's still it was only kind of resorted to two layers. I think maybe three in some places, but... Hey, guy. Alright, Abe. Calm down. I see you're there. You know, like, move. <laughs> Trying to tell me when to go. It's kind of funny that you actually did that as the in the actual game. I'm curious to also think if you did that in the original game. I don't think you did, but oh well. I'm going to wait. I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm just basically talking as long as possible to see if I can actually have him to actually recreate this little scene I've done before as well. Come on, come on, do it, come on, I want you to do it, do it, do it, do it, do it! <laughs> uh. Yes, 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 take cover and stand, or I could literally just oh, brainwash you right here and right now, and you can't do anything about it, laddie. But that's for lamos. But yeah, and see you guys in the next video. And remember, stay classy, guys, and have a good old day to you. Bye!